In this example, we're going to add to our master page that we created earlier in a tutorial. And if you did not create one, you can create one now. Just right click on master pages, add new item, and select master page, and give it a name frontend.master. Again, for this demo, I will be using Visual C Sharp. Then double click on front end master. Go ahead and between your div tags, you'll see your placeholder. Let's go ahead and delete that and start with a new div tag. And we'll create a page wrapper as our outermost div. And we'll create a header. And we'll create an anchor tag that's a server side anchor tag. And we'll use the run at equal to server code so it passes the request back to the server before delivering the browser to the new web page. Then we'll create a div tag that's going to contain our menu and then our main content. What we'll do is we'll add a content placeholder. You can drag it from your toolbox or you can just go ahead and type in your ASP colon content placeholder and set all your properties manually. We'll then go ahead and create our sidebar and our footer. I got one too many div tags in here, so I'm going to clean those out real quick. And we're going to go to our styles.css. We'll go back to design view. In our solution explorer, open your styles folder, grab your styles.css, and drag it onto the master page frontend.master. You'll notice that the CSS immediately applies to your master page, and you can see that a link was added to this styles.css file. In your purple text box, you'll actually see your content placeholder for your master page.